In July of 1945, the Allies met at Potsdam, and they issued an ultimatum to Japan, unconditional surrender or utter destruction. As they spoke, millions of troops were gathering for a final assault on the Japanese homeland. I was in deep despair and regarded myself on, say, August 1st, 1945. I regarded myself as dead already. I knew I was going to be killed. Paul Fussell, who had been wounded in Europe and patched up to fight again, was one of a million Americans preparing to attack Japan. I knew that I would be running up the beach at Kyushu. It was all planned. My division was to be in the first wave. I couldn't avoid being killed forever. As troops in the Pacific awaited their orders, a bomber named the In. It was a decision made by people who also did not understand the magnitude of what they had. Who could? We were at war, and we were fighting an enemy who uh, had not shown uh, any inclination toward mercy whatsoever. And we wanted the killing to stop. Truman said, I dropped the bomb, I made I had to retire to my little tent, close the curtain, and just sit there and cry for several hours. A very powerful emotional feeling to be redeemed from certain death into life again.